Nearly 80 years ago, under the leadership of the party and President Ho Chi Minh, the entire Vietnamese nation rose as one in the August General Uprising, breaking the shackle of colonialism and feudalism, and bring power to the people. On September 2, 1945, President Ho Chi Minh solemnly declared the birth of the Democratic Republic of Vietnam at historic Ba Ding Square in Hanoi. Recalling the historic day, it is necessary to talk about the unwavering support and special attention from overseas Vietnamese communities. A clear testament to this is the national flag displayed by Vietnamese expatriates in Paris during the first Independence Day celebration. The museum keeps and displays several flags from September 2, 1945, including one made by Vietnamese expatriates in France to celebrate Vietnam's independence. Mr. Dao Nguyen Din, who was involved in patriotic groups in France, looked after the flag and later donated it to the museum in 1959. It is a treasure because of the deep sentiment it carries from those living far from home. The flag is currently under preservation but you can still check it out on the museum's website. I'm really grateful for what our forefathers left behind. The flag especially catches my attention. Seeing how overseas could still stay connected to their homeland, as a young person, I'm even more determined to study hard and contribute to our nation's future. Every year, the celebration of Independence Day on September 2 reignites a profound pride in the heart of every Vietnamese. It is also an occasion to uphold the spirit of great national unity.